video is show you the resources section or the administration area of the system and in particular I'm going to focus on users and how a user or an administrator of the system would basically define the users so what we do is we go into the users section and we can see all the users we have here they're all listed by username the details the company any contact phone numbers that we have and email addresses for these admins and we can go into a existing user and we can see their current details listed here um, we have Arabic um, the time setting uh, the date format the kind of uh, variables for the uh, data they want to see and what we do is we can uh, specify the kind of service we want to provide them and give them options for allowing status request outgoing commands we allow them to stop a vehicle change the logic state clear the fleet uh, access to the wiring table which is something we have in our system for all sorts of different makes of cars and to sell to send commands via the mobile phone to receive um, notifications on the mobile phone and also to access monitoring um, what we can do is um, it's very easy in the system to um, add a new user um, we just go back into the users section and we create a new user very simply in here the default setting is the most basic so to add the more advanced features they would need to be defined and you would add all the information into the system here very simple very straightforward administration system which can be further defined as required based on each user that's added to the system or part of the organization that our client operates